welcome everyone to a brand new episode of Inside AMG. Guys, it's happening. We're right here for a lap record attempt with the AMG One driven by Mario Engel at the Nürburgring Nordschleife. We're gonna take you behind the scenes. Let's go and meet Mario right now in the workshop. Hi Mauro. Mathis, how are you doing? Very good, how about yourself? Very good, thank you. Yeah, fantastic. So we're here at the Nürburgring and it hasn't been too long since we met in Paul Ricard, but now we're here for another lap record attempt. And uh, we just saw you coming from the debrief. Um, how was your day going? How was the testing going? Yeah, it was a good day. Um, I mean, it's, I have to say it's always awesome to drive the AMG One on the Nürburgring Nordschleife. It's, it's always a special feeling. A uh, good day for me to, to get back into the, the groove, feel comfortable in the car, get the confidence up and, uh, and work with the whole team again and prepare tomorrow, essentially. It has been two years, so it was November two years ago, actually, where you set the lap record, which was a 6.35.183, which is fantastic. Uh, so now we're trying harder again. Um, what has changed throughout those two years? The track has changed, actually. Mm -hmm. uh, unfortunately, not in our favor. It's, it's probably just a, a couple of tenths slower, but uh, mm -hmm. the exit of the foxhole is now a big curb, which uh, you cannot use anymore. So it's a little bit slower in that section. Having new tarmac there, so that helps a little bit and compensates for some of the, the, the line that you cannot take. The car is unchanged. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, I mean, the biggest thing is the conditions. As we all know, you know uh, uh, there was more in it uh, two years ago. Uh, we, had, we found the conditions that we had at the time, so uh, given dry conditions, there, there's more, more possible. Yeah, I guess with all the data analyzers, because of some of you guys in the community have spotted the AMG One testing around the Nürburgring already, I guess you've collected lots of data now to be quicker. Yeah, for sure. This is, you know, this is uh, never a project where you just turn up on the day. It's always, there's a lot of preparation involved. Uh, it's a lot of teamwork with the whole team, with the AMG One team. Um, a lot of people involved from Afalterbach, um, from Bricksworth, um, just to, to, you know, get this project up and running again and to make sure that everyone's comfortable and especially myself as, as being the driver to get back in the zone and try to feel comfortable to extract every last tenth in, in all the corners. So we know the lap record from last time. What do you think you can achieve this time? Well, I think to be the first car under 6.30, that would be quite special. So uh, I think we can do it. Actually, I know we can do it. Let's see if uh, we can achieve it tomorrow and the conditions are right. My last question to you is, is there any rituals? Is there anything you do before uh, a record lap attempt? I don't know, a lucky charm or anything you take with me? Tell us about it. Uh, to be honest, the main focus now is uh, get a good night's sleep, have a good dinner, go to bed early, um, make sure I'm, I'm well rested and, and focused for tomorrow. Uh, we had our debrief with the team, so everyone's you know, focused on their part. Um, and uh, yeah, my part tomorrow will be uh, to drive it and uh, to drive it as fast as I can. Fantastic. So Mauro, thank you very much. Have a good rest, have a Thank good night, you. and I'll see you guys tomorrow, and I will see you guys tomorrow as well. Good morning everyone and welcome back on day two for a lap record attempt at the Nürburgring. As you can see, I'm wearing a raincoat because there has been some drizzle last night and the fog is still hanging around. So tricky conditions on the track still, so I'll take you to the workshop, let's check out what's happening today. Just coming back for a little chat with those guys. It's still very vague, actually, what the weather forecast says. Um, we don't know what's gonna happen, but those guys know their job. They're gonna prepare it in the best kind of way. We're just witnessing how the TÜV Rheinland is checking the car. That's the German authority actually to check if the car is either road legal and as well meeting all the rules which apply to a lap record attempt. So once we got the thumbs up, we are ready to hit the track. got the sun in my face, I can see blue skies there, you can see the clouds behind us. So that is the part of the Nürburgring which is the most impressive because you never know what the weather is going to do. So let's keep our fingers crossed, it's going to stay dry. Mauro's getting ready, the car is so, so let's see what we can do. Let's 
let's take the chance to ask Michael Schieber, the CEO of Mercedes-AMG, one very interesting question. Hi. Hi. Can I just disturb you for a moment? Yes, of course. Sorry, guys. Um, we're here with the community and we ask ourselves one simple question. I mean, we're number one, so why try harder? Why are we here? Oh, because at AMG it's all about ambition. Yeah. And we have the ambition to be the best on the racetrack. That's why we're here. And even if it is our, let's say, best lap time, we want to beat it. So it has been there for two years right now? Yeah. So we want to beat it and you've got a good feeling about it? I have a pretty good feeling. Tomorrow is perfectly prepared, so I'm pretty confident that we will make it. Fingers crossed. And I'll yeah. see you in less than six minutes and 35 see seconds. See you later. Okay, here we are. We're moments away from taking these cars out. First for the filming session and afterwards Mauro's gonna come back and jump straight in for his lap racket attempt. So let's hope he's not gonna build up the tension until the very last lap like always. Maybe he's get a good run in the first lap. shots are done, Mauro's back with the car, he's getting new rubber right now. Now we try to use the time because weather conditions seem much better than before, so we need to go out on track now to go for a lap record. Just as we wanted to start the lap, you see it's just starting to rain right here, so that's the Eiffel, everyone is hiding in the tent, and that's what I'm gonna do right now. Alright, that's it for today. After two days of full preparation of the car and ourselves, we have not managed to score a lap time at all. Mauro, what happened? Unfortunately, we never got a full dry track, which obviously is what we need. We've done the you know, partially damp track record laps in the past. Uh, right now we need a full dry track to show what the car is capable to do. And uh, we just never got that today. Uh, it was very close, really close. Uh, the track dried out nicely. And just before the last section dried out, we had a, uh, another rain shower hit. Uh, only a part of this track, uh, but uh, unfortunately, yeah. No chance today, so we'll have to look uh, and come back for the next attempt. Yeah, you say it. There will be another attempt in a couple of days. Mauro will be there, the AMG1 will be there, and we'll take you with us. So enjoy it the next time when we go for a lap record attempt. Welcome back everyone, after a couple of days for day number three. The car is back, Mauro is back, the team has prepared the car. We're now very excited because in a couple of minutes we're gonna hit the track. What a lap. Describe your feelings. Yeah, it's always a special feeling here. And I mean, uh, first first car, sub 6.30 is, uh, is pretty amazing. Um, yeah, very happy. Big teamwork, obviously. Um, we were patient with the, with the wet weather on, uh, on the first attempt. And uh, now we had good conditions. And uh, great to finally show what the AMG1 can, can do in good conditions. You say it finally because you had a couple of attempts. And it is, again, <laughs> the last lap you did it. Yeah, it's something uh, something about me in this car. It's always the last attempt. So uh, yeah, very happy with, with that lap and uh, yeah, uh, still pumping with adrenaline. Absolutely amazing. So guys, we need to celebrate right now. So once again, congratulations. Thank you. Well done. Thank you. 
All right, guys, that's it. We've made it. We scored a fantastic lap time. It was just absolutely amazing to see this full journey. And we took you with us. So now it's time to celebrate for us and we'll see you for the next episode.